Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix we could not install this update but you can try again error code 0x800F0922 or something did not go as planned, no need to worry, undoing changes, please keep your computer on. If you got this error during installing a Microsoft Cumulative Update for Windows 11, then don't worry. There's two possible fixes that can surely help to fix the problem. So let's get started. First, go to Windows Search and open the Windows Command Prompt as Administrator. Now type the command net space stop space proserve and press enter. Next type rd space for slash s space for slash q space percent system root percent backward slash software distribution and press enter. Next type net space start space word solve and press enter. This command will help to resetting the Windows update agent. After that, close the command prompt and restart your computer. Hopefully your problem will be solved. If not solved, then try to reset Windows update component manually. Go to Windows search and open the Windows command prompt as administrator. Type the command net space stop space bits and press enter. Next type net space stop space word serve and press enter. Next type net space stop space cry ptsvc and press enter. Next type these following commands as it is showing on the screen to rename the following folders to .vac files. After that press enter. And press enter. And press enter. Next, type this following command to delete the qmgr asterisk dot that file. After that, press enter. If qmgr asterisk dot that file cannot be found, then type this command lines as it is showing on the screen and press enter. After that, press enter. This command will help to reset the bits services and Windows update services to the default security descriptor. Next type cd space for slash d space percent winter percent backward slash system32 and press enter. Next type all of this DLL file as it is showing on the screen and press enter to register the bits files and windows update files. Next type net space winsock space reset and press enter to reset winsock. Now close the command prompt and restart your computer. After that, again open the command prompt. And type the command net space start space bits and press enter to reset the bit services. Next type net space start space raw serve and press enter to reset the windows update services. Next type net space start space cryptsvc 
and press enter to reset the cryptographic services. After that, close the command prompt and restart your computer. After restarting, check once if the Windows update issues are fixed or not. If not working, then don't worry, here's a certain tutorial for you. This is a bit time consuming, but I'm sure it will definitely help to fix the problem. So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question or any advanced guide, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.